Stranger things have happened in medicine. I once tried to clone a chicken. The result wound up being a man-sized chicken that was incredibly hostile and ended up escaping from the lab. Okay, Doc, we gotta have a talk at some point. Oh, yeah, and uh, that nice chicken outside gave me this coupon. I'm sorry, this is expired. You son of a... <laughs> Big guy? But you're probably never even gonna see him again. Hey, what the hell are you doing? You're supposed to arrest this guy. Relax, man. It's a party. That's enough. All right, you're coming with me, buddy. Listen, pal, I forgive you because you know not what you do, but get the hell out of here. I ain't leaving. You are. Oh, you think so? It was a chicken fight of biblical proportions. The giant chicken's Boba Fett. Wait, 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 hey, hang on, hang on. What are we fighting about? You know, I have completely forgotten. Me too. I, I, something about a coupon. I, I, all... I cannot for the life of me remember. Oh, hey. my God, that's ridiculous. You know what? I, I, I just, I hope I didn't hurt you. No, 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 I'm, 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 I'm all right. I'm all right. About that. But listen, you know what? Let me make it up to you. Why don't you let my wife and I take you out to dinner? Well, that sounds lovely. Oh, that was delicious. You know, I drive by this place all the time, and I, I've never been inside. Isn't that yeah, funny? Yeah, and, you know, Nicole and I came here by accident. We, we had reservations at another place, and they... Mm. Right, 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 honey? Yeah, they couldn't see us for like an hour, so we ended up coming here, and we just loved it. Loved it. I can see why. I mean, it, that, that halibut was... That that may have been the best halibut I've ever had. <laughs> well, I'm glad we talked you out of the pork chops, huh? <laughs> yes, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh let, let me... Let me, let me I, I get that. I'll oh, get no, that. no, 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 I got no, it. No, 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 I'm taking care of this. No, no. Oh, no, your money's no good here. No, my, my food was more expensive. I feel bad. If I, we I, invited I, you. I've got this. Look, just let go of the check, eh? You let go of the check. I'm not taking my hand off this thing. Well, neither am I. Let go of the check. Yeah, Ernie, if he wants to... Stay out of this! Don't you talk to my wife like that. Oh, yeah? What are you gonna do about it? Chris, get off there. You shouldn't be sitting on that. Come on! That's fake. Well, now I've seen Woodrow Wilson naked. On and on, he just keeps on trying. And his smiles when he feels like crying. Working squirrel. Making Neil Armstrong the first man to walk on the moon. Who knows? Maybe someone listening to this might be the first chicken to walk on the moon.
Has the jury reached a verdict? We have, Your Honor. And how do you find the defendant? Bacall or not Bacall? We find the defendant, Peter Griffin, Bacall. <laughs> My God, look at all this devastation. What the hell happened? <laughs> Even though you and Peter have your differences, I'm glad it hasn't affected our friendship. Us redheads have to stay together, right? <laughs> <laughs> so this is stuck at work. Honey, please. Lois is a friend. Really? Nicole, you got the wrong idea. How does this bitch know my name? Bitch? Okay, ho. Oh, I'm gonna enjoy this. Come on now, ladies. <laughs> Awesome. A chick chick and chick fight. Aha! <laughs> this must make you pretty happy. <laughs> Seeing me like this. I took too much ecstasy in my 20s, so nothing makes me happy anymore. What's wrong with you anyway? Bird flu. But there's a vaccine for that. Yeah, loaded with <laughs> mercury and antifreeze. <laughs> no, thank you. Ah, oh, I knew I hated you for a good reason. Hi, Peter. Hey. You just snubbed me in front of my own house. I thought we'd come to an understanding. Look, fella, I don't know who you are and I don't want to, so why don't you just go back to your crabgrass? This happens to be fresh marathon sod. <coughs> oh, man, I just got my memory back. And as I recall, I don't really care for you. <coughs> Wait a minute, who are you? <coughs> hey, I know you. <coughs> What's your beef, stranger? <coughs> well, if it isn't my old nemesis. There's nothing left for me in this world. I lost my job. I lost my house. My wife left me for a bigger cock. Cocks are chickens. I'm better off dead. Oh, that's sad. I agree. I guess that means I win, huh? I guess so. After all these years, who thought it would end like this? Yeah, it's uh, kind of anticlimactic. I always thought it would end with me eating, eating you, you for Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. Wait, birds eat people on Thanksgiving? Yeah. I gotta go. You get five minutes to say goodbye to your father. Sup, Ernie? Holy moly, that's a huge cock. I was starting to wonder whether the sister was even missing. And then a couple of friends pulled up. They cornered me in Kirstie Alley, the widest alley in Quahog. Hey, Matt. Fancy meeting you here. Well, if it isn't Bogey and Bacar. <laughs> I hear you've been snooping around the disappearance of a nun. Well, I didn't mean to ruffle anyone's feathers. Oof, again! Time of death, Bob. 808. I know numbers. It's just been revoked. I think he uses that wrong a lot. Come on, you gotta live, damn it! I need you! You do have something to live for! Me! You... Saved me? Why? Because I hate you. Every day I wake up not knowing if you're gonna come out of nowhere and punch me in the face. I flinch every time a door opens. I look over my shoulder every time I bend down to tie my shoes. And I flip my porch light on every night before I go to bed just to see if you're standing there. Do you have any idea how exciting that is? So I didn't save your life because I like you. I saved it because... Because I hate you. I hate you too, Peter Griffin. Also, if you die, I'll be solely responsible for all the destruction we've caused over the years, so this decision is both emotional and financial. <laughs>